Okay, so Movie HD needs to be updated, and it's not very straightforward. When I launch the app, it says there's a new version, and you can go ahead and click the update button. The problem is the new version is installed without removing the old version. So we'll go ahead and download it. to our device and it's downloading and now we hit the home button and if you get this pop-up that's great um, come over here and say open and it will load the installer and you can just go ahead and install it like any other app but now, after that installs, you actually have two versions. So I'm going to click Done. I don't want to open it yet. You actually have two versions of Movie HD on your device. The old one is still there. If we go to All Apps, you'll see that the old one is here, and the new one is shown up here. So the old one didn't. It stays on the home screen, the new one doesn't show. So we're going to actually remove this icon and the app from the home screen. So, oh, cancel. I didn't mean to click go. We're going to click home. To remove an app, it's real simple. You click on the icon, but don't click uh, short like I just did. You have to do a long click. So click and hold, and you get this menu. And first thing you want to do is uninstall, say OK. The one that's on the desktop is the old version. Now you're left with a question mark because the app is gone, but the uh, placeholder for it is still there. So long click on that and remove that from the home screen. So now that app's been removed, uninstalled. Now we go to all apps and there's only one version of Movie HD. If we long click on this from the list of all apps, it highlights and we can drag it from there onto the desktop. Now when I set up the uh, home page, I tweak this a little bit and notice in the bottom right hand corner you still have a maintenance box. Just grab that and drag it over and make it double wide if you want to. And you can long click on this, go to Options, go to Style, and give it that clear look so that it matches everything else. And now you should be able to click on that and the new version will come up. If we go to All Apps, you'll see that there's only the one version. Oh, it shows that there's two. There's actually only one version on here. I don't know why it shows two. Um, you should, you'll probably only show one. I probably need to restart my box. Okay, so that's how you do it. Um, if you have any questions, let me know.